aggregators questions. Hi, this is Cassie, and welcome to another neat question and answer, posted on Tim and Anthony's Web Traffic and Marketing Forum. If you haven't been to the Web Traffic and Marketing Forum, I suggest you do, as it really is a friendly and supportive community of like-minded people helping each other. The forum is located at www.webtrafficandmarketing.com. So Charlie, tell us the question. Hi, everyone. Here's a latest question. Does anyone know the answer to the following questions? Number one. For all those feed aggregators that have asterisk beside their domain, it means that there's a need to provide username and password in order to use their service. And I should disable the service if I do not want to provide the username and password. Number two. May, I know why, is some service that does not require to log in is disabled by default. Like, ngoid.sourceforge.net. Number 3. If I only want to use aggregator that does not require to create an A slash C and login, I should disable them. Because, I found that some required login aggregator is enabled by default. Like, overscript.dk. And now, for one of the answers that was given. As discussed in the installation videos, yes, the asterisk next to a domain means just that. The RSS aggregator has username or passwords set on their site, and to use it, you need to register and enter details. You can disable those few services, as you suggest, by clicking Disable. I was not aware that SourceForge.net was disabled by default, it should not be, by the sounds. For now, just click Enable, and I will check with the coders why this is the case. Note also, you can use the import or export functionality to copy settings of RSS aggregators to other sites to prevent you needing to do this manually in the future. In the case of Overscript.dk, they have only recently introduced a login after the last software update, so that is why you are seeing that. Well, you have just seen and heard another answer to a recent post at the Web Traffic and Marketing Forum. To find out more about this topic or many other Web Traffic and Marketing topics, visit the forum at www.webtrafficandmarketing.com right now. It's 100% free to join. Join the supportive online community and get answers to all your Web Traffic and Marketing questions. See you at www.webtrafficandmarketing.com Do it now and visit us today.